please remain standing for today's opening ceremony. The opening ceremony will be an invocation presented by Kevin Doomer, <laughs> president of the Tualatin, Oregon State, stake of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. President uh, Doomer is from Sherwood and is the guest of Representative Ben Bowman. Thank you. He set me up. My name is actually Kevin Dummer, and I like to joke that I'm dumber than anyone else here in the, uh, the, uh, the house today, so thank you. I, I appreciate being here. Um, it is a blessing for me to be here, and I'm, I'm grateful for this opportunity. I will, I will pray according to my faith tradition, but I recognize that as you represent me, uh, I don't necessarily represent you, and so I invite you, according to your own faith traditions, to add your faith and prayers. Uh, and if you're not of faith, to add your thoughts of goodwill. And uh, I'm grateful for all of those. My dear Father in heaven, I am grateful to be gathered here in this esteemed chamber with these representatives of the House in the state of Oregon. I'm grateful for their, their dedicated service, for their willingness to be courageous, to dedicate their time and talents for the blessing and the benefit of our friends and neighbors in this great state of Oregon. I am grateful that we live in this wonderful country where we have freedoms, freedoms to, to live, to act, to worship, to love, and to lead our, our lives according to the dictates of our own conscience. This is a great blessing for me, and I'm grateful that we all have that, that blessing. I'm grateful to live in this wonderful state of Oregon with the beauties that surround us, the landscapes, the ocean, the forest, the trees, the deserts. I'm grateful for the wonderful people of the state of Oregon. My friends and neighbors have been blessings to me and I am thankful for them. Once again, I am thankful for this, this group of individuals dedicating their time and talents. I pray that thou wilt bless them, that thou wilt bless them in their personal lives with their families and friends and partners, that they will feel a sense of community and love. I pray that they will feel loved by thee. I pray, Heavenly Father, that thou wilt bless them today in this session with wisdom, with courage and judgment, I pray that they will be the best version of themselves and that they will seek and look for and find the best version of their, their colleagues on whichever side of the aisle they, they stand. I pray that their hearts will, will yearn and lead towards the, those that they represent. I pray that they will strive diligently for policies and procedures that will bless all of us in our communities, and that they will look for opportunities to move our great state forward. We are blessed to be here in this, this wonderful state. Father, I also offer my, my heart and prayers to those throughout the world torn by, by war and conflict and strife. I pray that those struggling and suffering, whether it's mental, physical, emotional, or any other ailment, that, that they will receive comfort especially from friends and neighbors, and pray that we can find ways to reach out to those around us and, and serve and lift them. And Father, I, I also express my gratitude for the gift of thy son, Jesus Christ, for his life and his teachings and his example. I'm grateful for his resurrection, through which we all may resurrect and come to life after we have passed beyond, after our time on this earth has ended. I express my love to thee and again my gratitude for these uh, friends and neighbors and colleagues who are, are working diligently today on behalf of all Oregonians. And I pray for all Oregonians this day and I say this thing, these words in the name of Jesus Christ, amen. Thank you. Thank you. Courtesies, Representative Bowman. 
Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Uh, I rise for a second time to extend courtesies to Kevin Dummer, stake president of the Tualatin, Oregon Stake of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. I'd also like to extend courtesies to other members of the church that are here today. Uh, thank you for the beautiful invocation, and please join me in welcoming them to the Capitol. Thank you.